Greetings, fellow Clashers. It is your host, Galadon. You have tuned into Clash of Clans Attacks. Thank you very much for stopping by, but I also blame you, the viewer, for what is about to happen because in today's episode, I have succumbed to the viewer requests. I've corralled 165 hog riders. Yes, three attacks of 55 each. Probably not the best idea because with 55 hog riders, there is no room for anybody else. And as you know, hog riders go after defenses only until every single defense is down. Not the ideal hog rider attack, but nonetheless, here we go. This is probably not the best base to try with hog riders, but it has two single target infernos. Gosh, what if that is a double big bomb? I know that is the biggest, worst nightmare for a hog rider attack. I'm hoping those are Teslas. So let's just get in there. Let's try to lure out this clan castle. Yep, there's troops in the clan castle. So we are going to drop some hogs until we get all of those clan castle troops out. And uh, then we're going to try to bring them out to the outside here and lightning them out of existence. And uh, so it looks like that's probably all of them. And uh, now we've brought two lightning spells, so I'm going to try to drag these hogs, uh, drag drag the clan castle troops, rather, out over that mortar. Uh, not quite there. Stop. No, no. Stop, stop. Okay. Now we want to try to get them over the mortar as best as possible. That. Okay, this isn't quite going as planned. One more hog down here should do it. No. Nope. Okay. I think this is... Okay. No, too far. Okay, so one more. One more hog. Here we go. Okay. Stop, 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 stop. Uh, okay, I think this is as close as we're gonna get. Time for lightning. Come on, mortar and clan castle troops. Uh, okay, all right, close enough. Let's just go for it. Here we go. So we are dropping our hog riders in in two big long streams, heading down from the top of the village, and we're just gonna hope that they get in there. We're gonna put a heal spell down right over here and uh, hope that they get healed uh, a lot. And all right, so they're moving in. So now we're gonna try to drop another heal spell down where we think they're gonna head, and maybe a rage spell in that same area. Oh, Tesla's everywhere. Skeletons chasing all my hogs. This is not good hogs. Oh, I can never tell how these attacks go. Is it is it working? Is it not? Uh, we are gonna put the heroes in behind and uh, hopefully they will start to clean up and maybe help us get to 50% I don't know. This is not going like a uh, lava hound attack the hogs I can't even tell how many are left. There's so many skeletons down there. It looks like there's a clan castle Valkyrie Oh great, and now they're all coming for the king and the queen. No. Oh, and they're gonna split up into two groups It looks like that's even better all right, so King Special Ability, oh, Queen Special Ability, this is not good. Oh, and they run away from the Queen, and okay, so we've got them down, 31% damage, and there's, I have no control over the rest of this attack. I have absolutely no control. The hero's abilities have been used. They're just going to go where they go. 36%. There is a big bomb. Oh, that's going to take out almost all of the barbarians there. We've got the uh, defending archer queen just waiting to leap into action here as soon as we get through that wall. The king around the outside, 40%. Oh, this is not looking good. We're closing in on the town hall, but is it going to be enough? Oh, come on. She's on the town hall. She's working on the town hall, but that is a single target inferno, and we all know what that means. Yes, the queen is history. So, and the king, the king has been vaporized by the defending queen, and oh, and the attack is over. All right, so there we go. 25 trophies. So that pretty much went as expected, you have to admit. Uh, Galadon, not a big fan of hog riders, but for you guys, we went out and tried it again. So the second attack was done live as well, but somehow, for some mysterious reason, this audio track was misplaced, accidentally deleted, I guess. I did find a village that had two single target infernos. I tested the clan castle, found that there were balloons in there, which is just about the worst possible troop to go uh, to have come out of the clan castle when you're attacking with hogs. Uh, I only had one troop in my whole army composition that can even touch those balloons, and that would be the queen. Uh, so next, I dropped a couple of hogs at the top of the screen, testing for big bombs. The theory here, the hogs are going to outrun the balloons. Those balloons are too slow, so I just am uh, going to drop in all of my hogs from the top of the screen and hope that they go around the balloons, that they run away from them. And uh, so I put the two big streams of hogs in at the top of the screen, then I dropped the uh, clan castle hogs as well, and then the two heal spells that I brought, dropped them pretty early, one and then the second one off to the right to the second pack of hogs. The balloons start to go over the hogs on the left. That splash damage just devastating to hog riders. And sure enough, it is just going to be a few more seconds as the hogs stall up against the single targeting inferno and the balloons catch up, pretty much wipe them out on the left 
And then on the right, they're facing some skeletons, the Barbarian King as well. I dropped the heroes at the top of the screen, got the King going left, the Queen going right in hopes that they can at least get me to 50%. And now the balloons, of course, they've headed for my King, and he has absolutely no way to deal with them. So uh, once they catch up with him, he is going to be in big trouble. I've got his Iron Fist, but that is not going to do much. And uh, sure enough, I pop it, and he goes down very quickly anyway, even though those are not max level balloons. They just wipe him out, take care of the rest of his barbarians, and now they're going to go stalk my queen. She has wandered off to the right, and she is not doing a lot of damage either. She's gotten through the Tesla, the cannon, the builder's hut right there. 41% damage. It is not looking good. The defending barbarian king is laying in wait. Just as soon as she gets through that wall, you know he's going to come get her. I pop her royal cloak. Her archers move in, and a big bomb is going to take care of them. I drop a pretty much useless freeze spell. Now the balloons have caught up. I'm going to lightning the balloons and the king in just an utter panic. I try to drop the last freeze spell right as the attack ends. And there, kiss it goodbye, 32 more trophies. So yes, I am just terrible with hog riders. I've managed wins with all golems, all valkyries, even all wizards. And so I went out and tried one more time, and this time I found a village with sleeping heroes, which also luckily meant an empty clan castle and unarmed skeleton traps, a single target inferno on the left, the hogs moving in, a pretty well-placed heal spell right here is going to keep some of them up, terrible freeze fail, completely misses two nearby mortars, the second heal spell also in front of that group of hogs at the top of the screen. Now the second freeze spell, thank you, a little bit better that time, freezes both of the mortars so the hog riders are going to get through that splash damage and stop it before it wipes out too many more. And the rage spell, not really a big help there. They accelerate through but it doesn't do a lot of good. Now we've got skeleton traps so we drop the king and the queen at the bottom of your screen. There is one hog working on the archer tower and he does manage to take it out. But unfortunately not before I'm forced to pop the Queen's Royal Cloak and now I hit the Barbarian King's Iron Fist at the bottom hoping that those additional units will help with the cleanup. The last of the Hogs go down and they've left only two defensive structures remaining, a cannon and an archer tower. The King and his Barbarians deal with those skeletons no problem and now it is just going to be a race against the clock. Uh, will I have enough units? Will they take out the rest of these structures? Will anybody head for the Town Hall? We will shortly find out as that last goal Cold storage goes down and now they all go right past the town hall and then inexplicably for some reason just a few it looks like three or four barbarians have stayed behind to go after the wall the rest go up to the right the queen and her archers archers are stuck banging against two separate walls the queen rather than taking one more step and taking out that archer tower goes after a wall herself so I don't know what is going on with the AI of all these units as you look up above the queen you've got three separate barbarians going after three different walls, the Barbarian King going after a fourth. At the bottom right of your screen, the Queen's Archers finish one wall, and what do they do? They go after another wall, of course. So units all over the place focused on walls. The Barbarians do finally get through that wall and head for the Town Hall. Four Barbarians, and they're going to work on that Town Hall. Will 50 seconds be enough? Now the Archers are going to go join the Barbarians. We've got a little barge party at the Town Hall. Will they get through the Town Hall in time? Will these other units at the top of your screen manage to clear out the rest of these structures? It is going to be close. 83% damage, and now the King is working as the Queen's bodyguard. He is in front of her. But in yet another bizarre twist of fate, the cannon focuses on the queen rather than the king, wipes her out, the cannon goes down simultaneously, and that leaves the king banging up against the wall. No defensive structures remain, but there is just simply not enough time on the clock to get through these last structures. Certainly not as frustrating as a loss, but frustrating nonetheless. So close to a third star, but we will be stuck with two stars, 97% damage as time runs out. And now I truly hope that your bloodthirst for Hog Rider attacks by Galadon has been quenched. Please don't ask me to try that again. I will be back tomorrow with more high-level strategy and clan war attacks and replays. But in the meantime, please do be sure to leave your comments and feedback down below. Let me know what you would like to see. I am always happy to do my best to fulfill reasonable subscribers' requests. Check out my other videos, and I will see you tomorrow with more full attacks. Galidon, they want more Peter 17 dollars, of course.